Who took my toes? Where's my bag? Oh, it's somewhere underneath there. No manners. Come on, Violet. Coco is already waiting. Violet, don't forget, I'm getting you from school later, okay? See you. You better hurry. Okay. Come, let's go. Yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Hey, Ma and Pa still not out of their room yet. You think they fought last night? Did you hear anything last night? No. Maybe Cold War. Maybe. I hope Pa is not in a bad mood. Otherwise, we're going to get it in the shop. Keep low profile. Don't say or do anything to get him angry. Okay. <laughs> good morning. Hey, good morning. morning. Settle your own breakfast. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Mama? Papa? Eh? Eh, Fig. What are you doing here? Mama, aren't you on MC? I'm just picking up some groceries on my way to work. Your Baba insisted on coming with me. On your way to work? You should be at home resting. I can't take the day off. Too much to do. Your mother is so stubborn. She has a medical appointment later, lunchtime. And I'm going to make sure she goes. Eh, no need. I can go myself. Mama, come on. Okay, how about this? You take the day off and we go on a family outing. It's not every day that Baba doesn't have coaching sessions and you have an excuse to skip work. I can't sabo my colleagues like that. You two go ahead, okay? Go ahead without me, all right? Mama. I'm serious. Ah, give up, Fit. Her mind's made up. You two go and spend your day together. Okay? Don't worry about me. I have lots to do. Collect the dry cleaning, go to the bank. Okay? Go, go. Eh, hey, uh, sayang, sayang. Uh, wait, wait, wait. You left your wallet and phone with me. I don't know what I'd do without you, sayang. Okay. Go. Hey, wait, girl. Hey, you're Alex's daughter, right? Cannot any of us send you like that? Oi! Hey. Who is calling stranger? You are. Her grandfather now. Let go of her. Hey, you. Uh, uh, uh. Dr. Teh, sorry, I uh, didn't recognize you. You think I'm a kidnapper, is it? You look more like one than I. Uh. Uncle, I was at the wedding. Alex friend. You, you don't recognize me? Uh? A word of advice. Uh. Stop approaching young girls uh, on the streets uh, and grabbing them like that. Come. Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm just trying to help. Hey, bro. Hafiq, I'm sorry about yesterday. My wife can be quite pushy. No worries. I hope she's not still hung up over their contract. Actually, I don't think anything is going to change her mind. I'm sorry, but I really think you have to hold up your end of the deal. Come on, bro. You know I didn't really sign that. Can you really see me as some TCM spokesperson? In 50 years, maybe. Do you really want to be sued by my wife? That's where you come in. She's your wife, right? Handle her. But I... Thanks for waiting. Ah, am I interrupting something? No. Let's go. I'm sure you can take care of things, right, bro? Thank you. Samu? Hungry. Everything tastes so good. How is your stomach? Oh, okay, ready. Thank you. Baba, the Saito E porridge you cooked for me helped me settle everything. So, are you going to make an appointment with the urologist? Is it recommended? Please. Let me eat in peace, can? Be serious. You want me to call him for you? These Western doctors will just only give the medicine to treat the symptoms. They don't know how to get to the root of the problem. I really think that you should go and see the urologist. Just hear what he has to say. 
Hey, these Western doctors really make me kanchong. Why so kanchong? Why you like to sneak up behind us? And stop stealing our breakfast. Mm, nice. Fig, you must have recovered from your jet lag already, right? Up uh, for another game? Baba, you got lucky the last time. Might not get so lucky this time. Ah, don't talk big lah. We play first, then we will know. I'll let you off this time. How about we go cycling instead? Remember when you used to take me cycling around East Coast Park? Of course I do, son. I miss those days. So, how about it? Hmm, sure. Is it really you, Happy Ibrahim? The one and only. Me and my friend are playing badminton. Would you like to join us? Uh, yeah, of course. Hafiq Ibrahim never lets his fans down. Go. <laughs> Easy on them, huh? All right, let me pull up your file. OK, so all your test results are in. Dr. Tay, in my line of work, I'm used to handling difficult information. You can just be straight with me. It's chronic immune thrombocytopenia. ITP is an autoimmune disease where your immune system attacks your blood platelets, causing you not to have enough of them. Is it very bad? Thankfully, your platelet count is not dangerously low as of yet. You can get by with medication and proper rest. It shouldn't affect your life too much. <sighs> but you need to be careful. Because with a low platelet count means that your body is more susceptible to bruises, injuries and anemia. So I just need to be careful. You should also consider taking a break from work. But I can't stop. No, Rani. We know how it's like in social services. The stress isn't going to help a condition. You can always return after you get a handle on this. I'll think about it. Okay. Regular blood test must from now. Is your husband here with you today? No. Can he come with you the next time? It's okay, I can come by myself. Your condition will be a lot easier to manage if you can rely on family for support. Okay, don't be tense. Good. Relax. Use your wrist more. Now, his left side is open. Go. Very good. We did it. 10-1. Let's wrap it up. So fast. Hey, boy, keep practicing, okay? Who knows? You'll be able to play with a champ again someday. Maybe even an official match. 10-1. <laughs> you went a little too easy with them. Baba, they're kids. We need to keep their dreams alive. Think of how successful we will be when we open a badminton academy together, Faye. Mama. Yes, Ayang. Fig is with me. What's wrong? Okay. We'll go and find you. Yeah. <sighs> Your mother. She just finished a medical checkup. She wants to see us so urgently? Do you think it's bad news? Autoimmune disease? Doctor said it's not serious. But what does that mean? Do you need to quit your job? Tak, tak. No. But tonight, we eat out, OK? Uh, I have too much work. No time to cook. <sighs> you are still thinking about work. Sayang, you should just quit your job. It's not like we need the income. Your son here can support us. Nonsense. Hafiq should focus on his own career and recovery. No need to worry about me, OK? The ITP is nothing serious. Nothing needs to change. Okay? Tap our lunch for the office again. Ah? Yeah, have to work at the same time. Take a few more bottles for your colleagues. Wow, so generous. Ah. I told Nelly everything, Ray. Good. So she won't ask me so many questions anymore. Yep, don't worry. Go, you better keep an eye on your boy. Anthony, for what? 
I heard rumours about him fooling around. Nonsense. Stupid rumours. Anthony won't do anything behind Paling's back. He's not that kind of person. Anyway, he's your boy. So big. Hey, Ibrahim. Hey. <laughs> Thanks for meeting me, Alex. I just needed someone to talk to. Sure, anytime. Uh, what is this about? It's my wife. Oh. She got diagnosed with some autoimmune disease. She says the doctor said it's not serious. Just monitor and get more rest. And you think she's not telling you everything? I know she doesn't want me to worry. The thing is, her job, Alex, she has to listen to other people's problems all the time. Solve it. Sometimes you cannot solve it, lah. Yeah, it can be emotionally exhausting. Yeah. yeah. And she won't quit her job. You know my son, Hafiq? Yeah. He is quite settled. He earns enough. Um, has Hafiq told you about... Uh... We need to take it to the next level. Make sure Hafiq, his talent and his prize money takes us to the next level. What do you mean? We should get started on our sports academy ASAP so that my wife can quit her job. No excuses. Sports Academy? Uh, does Hafiq know about this? Yes. Hafiq is all for it. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, if you need any help, just let me know. You're always a big help, Alex. Eh? Thanks for listening. No problem. I need to go. Okay. Hello, Violet. It's me, uh, Uncle Chan. Remember me? Oh, uh, eh, he, your Kong Kong is not here, right? Just now, uh, when he shouted at me, uh, so scary. <laughs> I nearly she in my pants. <laughs> uh, are you lost? Uh, don't worry. Uncle Chan will help you. If anyone asks, say I'm helping you, okay? I'm not a stranger. I'm your papa friend, Uncle Chan. Come, let's go. Hey, Hafiq. Glad I ran into you. What's up? So your dad and I were talking, right? And he mentioned something about you guys opening up a sports academy? Oh, yes. It's always been a dream of his. I remember you telling me about your financial situation, so if you need help... It's still a way off. We've barely talked about it. Really? You might want to double check with your dad, uh, just to be sure. Or I have to go get Violet from school. Talk to him, okay? Hey, Miss Wilford. Sorry I'm a bit late. Is Violet ready to go? Uh, Mr. Rajendran, she said you were picking her up outside. I thought you picked her up already. Um, if she comes back, can you please call me and uh, keep her here? Yeah. Uh, Christine. I wake up in the morning and Chandra is sleeping. Sun in my eye and I think I'm... What on earth? I wake up in the morning and Chandra is snoring. Sun in my eyes, I think I go... Chan! Huh? Oh, wait, wait, wait. Okay, wait. What is all this and what are you doing, Violet? Huh? Nothing, what? She was lost. Did she call Alex? Huh? Uh, I don't have his number. Or me, his friend. Oh, yeah. Oh, cut him away. She's not at home. I've asked around. I've checked with shopkeepers. I, I'm so sorry. I... Save it for later. Let's focus on buying Violet first. Miss Chandra. Hello? Alex, are you looking for Violet? Yeah, is she with you? Yeah, she's OK. She's OK. I'll bring her over to your place. All right, I'll see you in 10 minutes. Thank you, man. Let's go home. It's not like your father to be so late. And he's not picking up my calls. Maybe he ran into one of his students' parents again. So how was your day? It was fine. Nice to spend some time with Baba. Was it really? I can tell when something is bothering you. Actually, there's something I need to get off my chest. Sorry I'm late, but wait till you see what I've been up to. You told the whole world we're opening a badminton academy? I did! Surprise! <laughs> 
Baba, why didn't you tell me you were going to do this? Yeah, why so sudden? I wanted it to be a surprise. <laughs> look, ah, look, look, look at this. My students are already signing up. It's too soon. You are here now. Soon we'll be off competing again. We should get started. Starting an academy is going to be very expensive. This is not the time to get cold feet. Vic, has this got to do with what you wanted to tell me just now? Actually, she didn't want to follow me at first, but then I promised to <laughs> buy her sweet. <laughs> You used sweets to lure her into your flat? Uh, that's not what he means. Uh, it is what I did. <laughs> hey, he's very blurred. He's in a messy bodo. Oh, is he what? Oh, you're not. And Violet, how many times have I told you not to talk to strangers? Worse, follow them? He's not a stranger. He was at your wedding. That's mm. true. We are friends. Right, Violet? I wake up in, in the, the morning, I see Chandra snoring. The sun in my eye, and I think I want to fly. Yes, yeah, see? Learn so fast. <laughs> Is that a famous song? Alex. It's catchy tune. <laughs> I compose. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. You're missing something very important here. Don't do this again. Next time you see a child wandering about, you call the police. Or call Chandra. Uh, uh. Hey, hey. Oh, oh. But why are you so sensitive? Uh? Hey, if not for me, they would have called the police. I definitely would have. <sighs> What's the big deal? They investigate, I explain. Everything will be okay, one. Right about it. Hey, hey. Both of you are same, same. So serious. Why do you throw this away? I told you already. I'm not going to see a Western doctor. Just give it a try. Enough. I don't want to talk about this anymore. Can you at least go for a medical checkup? For what? I'm okay, what? You are supposed to do it regularly. You've not gone for over a year already. No need. I'm planning to go for one. Let's go for it together. It's just a checkup. Okay, Pajani. Okay. But just a normal checkup. Nothing else. Last time, I used to babysit my friend's daughter. She was the one who taught me how to fold this. Babysitting is very different, huh? Yeah. Trying to be nice was also so difficult. Chan, today's world is very different. Last time, I let my son go everywhere. Today, you're very precious. You never mentioned your son before. Oh, uh, he's in overseas. Start his own family and everything. Good for you. I never had my own children. Maybe I should have. Oh, well, charming fine. I never thought I'd have a decent conversation with you. Well, eh? no. I need to go to toilet. Number two. Don't do that again, okay? You cannot follow strange men just because they promise you sweets. Well, Uncle Chan is nice. Anyone can pretend to be nice. Yeah. Next time you get lost, go to a shop and call the police, okay? I'll call mommy. Do you remember mommy's phone number? So what do you do at Uncle Chan's house? Eat kueh for origami and sing song. Nice. You have fun? Don't encourage her. There wasn't any real harm done and she had fun. So all's well that ends well, right? Gross, Violet, stop that! 
Where did you learn to do that? I saw Uncle Chan do it. Uh, okay, maybe some harm was done. Violet, um, you cannot do that, okay? Because uh, your fingers will get dirty and you'll fall sick. And it's gross. Or that. Should we tell Mom? I read that article. Are you sure you can afford to start a sports academy? Nope. But my father still thinks that I have the money too. You mean you haven't told your parents what happened? And your wife hasn't changed her mind about suing me? Here. My badminton stuff. Oh, <gasps> it's your medals! And signed autographs from Chen Long, the Sidate brothers, all five of them. Lee Chong Wei, Taufik Hidayat, and that badminton racket right there. I won my first championship with it. It's signed too, so it should fetch a high price. Are you serious? You're going to sell all of this? Not me. You are. I can't be seen selling this stuff. Just keep whatever I owe you and return the rest back to me. This means something to you. Once it's sold, there's no way you're getting it back. Well, it's either that or my father's dreams, right? Biscuits again. Saving money is important, but you should take better care of yourself. Cannot let my son's girlfriend get malnourished, right? Chi, <laughs> I promise you, we are not a couple. I don't know why he said all that during that live stream. I was joking. Have you noticed any difference in Hafiq lately? Uh, no. Why? Nothing. I feel like he's hiding something. Something serious. <laughs>